it's Rose. And I am back with you to do another unboxing. But this is special because what I'm doing, this is going to be a three-part unboxing um, because I have three little diamond paintings that I bought at Laoji Yuan. Um, and they all have very similar subjects. And what I did was I bought one in crystal drills, one in square drills, and one in round drills so that we can compare what those three from the same company look like uh, in similar but not identical diamond paintings because I don't know about you, but seriously, I could not do three of exactly the same diamond painting. Uh, even for you, as much as I love you, I don't love you so much that I'm going to do three diamond paintings exactly the same. Okay, so I have to actually open this next kit to get at my other two China doll diamond paintings. So um, I do have another 50 by 40 diamond painting that I bought, but I'm not going to open that right now. I'll open that in a separate video. Now, once again, this shipment got a little bit crunched in shipping as well, but I'm not concerned. Uh, that's not going to hurt the diamond paintings. Uh, the diamond paintings will be just fine. I have quite a pile of... Um, wrapping paper and boxes and stuff on the floor. This is the, uh, this will be the fourth and the fifth one that I unboxed today. So, all right, so I'll show you the two others that I got since I've got them both here. Uh, what do I call them? Um, this one I call China Doll Number One, black and pink. And this one I call China Doll Number Two, blue and olive. And that's because of the predominant colors in the diamond paintings. So let's do number two. I don't keep these boxes, I get rid of them. Uh, what I do keep are the little stickers of the thumbnails that they put on the tongue of the box. There we go, all right. And I keep those with the drills so that I can just look at the drills and know exactly what diamond painting they go with. Okay, there's nothing else in there. I like the fact that even for 30 by 40s, they put them in boxes. Not all companies do that. Some companies, if it's more than, like they'll only do it if the smallest dimension is 40 centimeters, but Lao Ji Yuan does it for all of their diamond paintings. So that's really, really nice. You pay a little bit of a premium for their diamond paintings, but uh, I'm kind of, kind of convinced, I'm pretty convinced that uh, it's worth it. Okay, so let's take a look. Here is the thumbnail. It's a very dark background, uh, but that's kind of like, I, I think it's a dark, dark sort of, I don't know, bluey green. And then there's the beautiful blue and turquoise and then olive in her, uh, in her kimono. I don't know if that's a kimono. I don't know. Anyway, uh, this one has 22 colors. So the other one had 13. Okay, so this one has a lot more colors. It was the same price. 
So earlier I opened the diamond painting and I said they charged more according to the number of diamonds or the number of colors. That's not right. Uh, I don't know what they charge more according to, but anyway. Because I bought two 40 by, like I opened two 40 by 50s and they were different prices. One was round, uh, was pebble. The other one was, um, the other one was uh, square and the square cost more, so I don't know. Okay, this one is regular round drills. They include a little bit of foam core in there. So, again, we have the kit, the wax, the boat with a cutout, the multi-placer, single placer with cushy. pull back the cover on this cover comes up nicely the canvas is pretty much perfect yeah these can these covers are coming up much more easily than the ones on my 40 by 50s that I opened earlier this morning. Well, not this morning, it was earlier today. Um, okay, so there we go. So that's the, that's the image there. Um, I will show you the colors on the legend and then the drill field. So there we go, there's our 310. They always use the black circle or the white circle on the black background. So this one has a lot more dark colors than I have ever bought in a uh, Lao Ji Yuan diamond painting. But when you take a look, all of the symbols are very, very easy to distinguish. Now we do have a lot of black here because that's the color of her eyes, or, or her hair rather. Um, and then it appears less frequently elsewhere in the diamond painting. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna bring you back up, put you back. And we're, I'm going to, I hope I'll be able to shoot the last one in this series today. It's just that the sun is now starting to make shadows that I don't necessarily like. Um, yeah. Okay. All right. So let's do an inventory of the drills. So this one, it's all the same information as the one before. I'll flash that up on the screen right here. And if I can get into these drills, we'll be off to the races. All right, so this is my first ever regular round drill diamond painting from Lao Ji Yuan. Um, I've always ordered only their uh, pebble round before, uh, so never just their regular round. I think I have another diamond painting from them that was square, um, square drills, that I bought recently. Um, you'll see the unboxing for that. Uh, I don't know, you probably will have already seen it by the time this goes up. Anyway, okay, uh, I'm gonna bring it down so that you can see what I'm doing while I do inventory. All right. So again, Lao Ji Yuan prepackages all of their drills according to weight. I have had nothing but good experience with the quantity of drills that they provide for the crystal drills, so I'm not concerned about the quantity of drills for my round, okay? Uh, so I'm not gonna measure, like I'm not gonna weigh them to see whether they got the weight right. I'm just going to trust that it's right. So 
So there's our 500. I'm not going to put the flash on just simply because uh, my battery's running down. 646. Yeah, this is much less uh, bright than a lot of the ones that I buy. Um, and I'm now wondering whether it was a good one to buy for the purposes of this comparison experiment uh, because, okay, there's a lot of 310s, 23.23 uh, grams. Um, because, um, like what I want to show off is the sparkle and the total effect at the end. Now, that would ideally be done with three diamond paintings of the same picture done in different drills. But I just, like I say, I, I just, I couldn't bear to do four diamond, the three diamond paintings of the same image. So what I did was pick three images from what I call the China Doll series. And, um, and we'll do a comparison at the end of what they look like. Now I probably won't be able to start these until sometime in January at the earliest because I've got a whole bunch of diamond paintings that I have to do for Christmas. And so my ones that are for fun for me, uh, they are relegated to the bottom of the um, order. 38, 32, so that's about the, the brightest color <laughs> In this diamond painting and I think it uh, where does it go where does it go hmm. I don't see where it goes there's not too much of it where wherever it goes there's not too much of it anyway okay uh, 934 why did I pick this one I don't know I mean, they're all kind of cute. And I wanted to get ones that had more or less the same level of detail, but I don't know why I got this one since the level of darkness is considerably more than the other one. All right, 3371, 223 and two more 931 what's this 3845 okay so we'll just run my finger down the list here make sure everything's ticked yes it is okay so there we go that's our second one and what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to put the drills for these in um, baggies because uh, what I'll show you afterwards is just the baggies uh, lined up one beside the other and the diamond paintings one beside the other uh, so that you can see what it is that uh, I'll be working on to do the comparison. So, all right, uh, I'm going to set this aside once I label all this stuff, and I'll be back to you with China Doll number one. Mm -hmm.